Sup sup everyone and welcome to episode 19 of my Pokemon Leaf Green Let's Play. Last episode we took down Sabrina and got the secret key from the Pokemon Mansion on Cinnabar Island. We're going back to back episodes battling gym leaders, but before we walk in, a little bit of housekeeping. First of all, shout out to Squidman for naming Aerodactyl Terry. Congrats for winning! Secondly, as of recording, I am at 74 subscribers, so we are only 26 away from the first ever subscriber challenge on my channel. If we can get to 100 by the time we battle the 8th and final gym leader, I will let you guys decide on which Pokemon to replace and what Pokemon to replace it with. Um, probably a little heads up, we're probably going to be doing the 8th and final gym in 2-3 to three episodes, I want to say, so um, time is running out, so make sure you share this video you like you comment on this video you share it with your friends and family get everybody to subscribe and join the really timmy b gang let's do this everybody uh and then the last thing we have a bunch of medicine so let's go ahead and give that to some of our pokemon we're going to start off with protein protein raises the attack stat so we're going to give one to spike and we got two more one's definitely going to chonk and let's give one to Terry as well. Terry is going to be a nice little attacker for us. So Terry, Chonk, and Spike get some much-needed protein. Iron raises defense. Well, Chonk is definitely getting some, some iron. Who else needs some good defensive uh, Spike? It's probably going to be the same Pokemon attack and defense. Kind of go hand-in-hand -hand with Pokemon, you know, especially with physical attackers. So we'll give one to Terry as well. Um, and final one, we're going to give to Chonk. He is going to be a tank next up we have zinc which raises the special defense so we'll give one to lana we'll give one to littlefoot and we will give one to usain as they are more special attackers and special defenders and pokemon will be using special attacks and and all against these pokemon so we're gonna balance out our medicine a little bit let's see what else is next carbo's speed um this is a tough one. Like, do I give it to Chonk, who needs a little bit of speed, or do I give it to Terry or Lana, who's super fast? We'll give one to Usain. Uh, we want to be faster than everybody. We'll give one to Chonk, and we'll give one to we'll give one to Terry. Oh, it won't have any effect. Okay, let's give one to Lana then. We'll give we'll, we'll raise some Lana speed. And finally, we have Calcium, which is special attack. So one of them is definitely going to Lana. Uh, with Water Psychic being both special, and then we'll give one of Usain with Electric also being a uh, special attack. Excuse me, I'm sorry, and I believe that's all we have. Yeah, so that's all the medicine that we have. Let's hop into the gym. The Cinnabar Gym is a Fire-type gym, so this will be a ex great experience for Lana, Terry, and Spike. Now, in order to get the Blaine, there are two options. You can either battle the trainers... Or you can answer these questions. It's uh, Now it's time for a Pokemon quiz, and let's test our Pokemon knowledge. Get it right, and the door opens. Get it wrong, and face a trainer. Caterpie evolves into Metapod. Yes, it does. We're absolutely correct. Go on through. Don't need to battle you. Don't need to battle you. What is the next question? Get it right, and the door opens to the next room. Get it wrong, and face a trainer. If you want to conserve your Pokemon for the gym leader, then get it right. Here we go. There are nine certified Pokemon League badges. Well, as I just said about a minute and a half ago, I said uh, the subscriber challenge goes until we get to the eighth and final Pokemon gym leader. So there are eight gym badges. So the answer is no. And we are absolutely correct. Go on through. What is the next question? Question three. Let's see it. Yes, same old, same old. Poliwag evolves three times. Now, this was a little bit of a trick question. I want to say especially back when I was younger because there are three Pokemon in the Poliwag evolution time. But Poliwag only evolves once in the Poliwhirl and then twice again into Poliwrath. So the answer is no. But I can see everybody's confusion if you were to say yes, because there are three Pokemon in the Poliwag line, but it only evolves twice. Let's see what we got here. Question, this is question four, right? And are electric moves effective against ground-type moves? 
Well, we found from firsthand experience that the answer is no, uh, as we saw Spike take down Lieutenant Surge many, many episodes ago. So that is a no-ski for that one. Question five, six, I don't know. Question five. Pokemon of the same kind and level are not identical. That is correct. Every Pokemon is different in their own way, um, especially depending on IVs and EVs uh, of your Pokemon stats could be a little bit different. So if you are the same level and same kind, it is not the same Pokemon. And final question. TM28 contains Tombstoney. Never heard of Tombstoney before, so we're going to go with no. We are absolutely correct. 100% A+. Super duper. I know Craig will be proud of me for getting all of these right. And so we are at Blaine. But like I said, this is great experience for Lana, Terry, and Spike. So I'm actually going to go ahead and battle all of these trainers. I will see you in just a quick second once I am back here at Blaine. Alright, we are back here at Blaine, ready to take him on throughout the uh, grinding in this gym. Lana got to level 40. I don't know if Lana can do this whole battle herself, so we will have to rely on Terry and Spike more than likely. And Chonk will be there, as always, uh, to save us if need be. So let's just hop in and let's talk to Blaine. Ha! I am Blaine, the Red Hot Leader of Cinnabar Gym. My fiery Pokemon are all rough and ready with intense heat. They incinerate all challengers. Ha! You better have Burn Heal. And we are battling Gym Leader Blaine. Uh, he will have four Pokemon. The first one will be Growlithe. Growlithe will be no will be level 42, as you can see. Everybody can read numbers. It will know Bite, Boar, Takedown, and Fire Blast. So Bite could could it's super effective against Lana, so it could do some damage. But Surf is going to take it down in one hit. So, well done, Lana. Actually, Blaine, Arcanine. Um, let's keep this out. Lana might go down to Arcanine. It will be level 47. This is one of the strongest Pokemon in the game. Uh, or Arcanine, not Blaine's Arcanine. It will know the same attacks as his Growlithe. Bite, Roar, Takedown, and Fire Blast. Let's see how much Surf does. All right, so two Surfs will do the job. Let's see what Bite does here. Uh, yeah. Yikes. So we're just going to surf it down. He'll use a Hyper Potion. He might use another Hyper Potion, but not to worry. We have plenty of surfs for his team. It's super effective. Yep, so our K9 goes down, and the rest of this battle should be pretty easy. His next Pokemon will likely... Well, it will be a Ponyta or Rapidash. Let's see what he comes out with. Lana, level 41. Welcome to the club. So Ponyta is next. Uh, let's give let's give Terry some more time. Terry just got named. Thank you again, Squidman, for naming Terry. And let's get Terry some 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 battle action in a gym. Ancient Power Rock is super effective against Fire type, so it'll go down in one hit. We're super super fast, and we'll leave Terry out for his final Pokemon, which is a Rapidash. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, well, Rapidash knows the same moves as Ponyta. Ponyta was level 40, Rapidash is level 42, and they both know Stomp, Bounce, Fire Spin, and Fire Blast. So as long as you have a Water-type Pokemon or Rock-type Pokemon like Terry, or even a Ground-type Pokemon with Spike and a move like Dig or Earthquake, Blake is gonna, or Blaine, not Blake, Blaine is gonna be super easy. I have burned down to nothing. Not even ashes remain. You have earned the Volcano Badge and 4,700 Poke Dollars. Hey. Ha! The Volcano Badge heightens the special stats of your Pokemon. Here, you can have this too. We received TM38. Fire Blast is the ultimate fire technique. Don't waste it on water Pokemon. I'm not even sure water Pokemon can learn this, Blaine. Can Lana learn Fire Blast? No. Oh, Chonk can't. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, we, we might have to put Fire Blast on one of our Pokemon. Uh, that was awesome. So now, as we walk out of the gym, we're just going to take our sweet time, lament in this victory. We took down Blaine. We have seven of the eight Pokemon gym badges, which was the question right there in that little machine. 
If there are nine, there are not. There are eight. So we are almost on our way to becoming Pokemon Champion. Hello. Huh? Hey, if it isn't Timmy B. Look, it's me, Bill. Long time no see. Oh, uh, yeah, Bill. Actually, it has been a while. It's been about 15 episodes or so since I've seen you. I hope you're still using my PC system. Well, kind of, Bill. Well, listen, since we met up here, how about spending some time with me? Uh, uh, uh okay. Okay, Bill. There's this little island in the far south called One Island. A friend invited me, so I'm on my way out there. How about it? Do you feel like coming along with me? Uh, one island? We just beat a gym leader? Luxury cruise? Luxury island? We're gonna go with yes. Alrighty then, let's go. Oh, Bill, that is a nice... Yeah, oh, it's your pal's boat. Always be the friend who has a friend who has a boat. You never want to be the person with the boat. You want to have a friend who has a boat. Little life advice for everybody. Here we are. This is one island. There are several islands around here, and this is one of them. My friend Celio sent the boat to fetch me here. He's in charge of the island's PC network by his lonesome. Why am I telling you this now? Let's just go see Celio. This is a nice addition to the Fire Red and Leaf Green games. Was uh, the Sevi Islands, as we'll find out in probably in just a second. Uh, this is Celio. He's another PC maniac, much like... Bill, yes, Bill, I'm trying to become Pokemon Champion. Thank you, Celio. Thank you, thank you. PCs on this island just can't link with your PC, Bill. Oh, yeah? Well, let me take a look-see. Hang on here. So we got to go to Two Island. There's a guy who runs a game corner. We need, a, we need to deliver a meteorite to him. But Bill, I want the meteorite. I want it. And we got the Tri-Pass. This will allow us to travel to one island, two island, and three island. Uh, and then once we open up the... Once we become League Champion, there are an extra four islands. So, going to be very exciting to get there when we get to post-game. I'm just going to heal up real quick. That way we're at full health, just in case we do run into any battles. We will be exploring one island a little bit more next episode. Uh, which I think you guys will enjoy, and I guess I'll just say it right here. Next episode, we are going to hunt down and hopefully catch all three of the legendary birds in Moltres, Zapdos, and Articuno. Uh, it's up here this way, but we won't go there for now. We will explore one island next episode. And there's not too many new Pokemon that you can catch here on one island, at least in... in oh, wait, wait, wait. Did I say two island? I, well, I hope so. Yes, we're at Two Island, but uh, the Pokemon on One Island you can only really catch that are new, I would say, would be Tentacruel, Seedra, Gyarados, or Kingler in the water. Pretty much the same here. Uh, you can catch a Golduck in Fire Red, a Slowbro in Leaf Green, and in the Grass, which we'll get to in just a second, a Gloom, Weeping Bell, and Poliwhirl. So, all Pokemon that we've been over, there's just a higher chance that you can catch them here, and at this point in the game, they'll be at a reasonable level to, to join your team if you choose to, to add them, so. So, let's explore Two Island a little bit. Let's actually just hop on the bike. Uh, this is the grass that I was talking to you about. And let's see if we do get around Pokemon. What is it? What is it? Oh, Spiro. Okay. Wow. How exciting. Spiro. So, you can also catch a Spiro here. Fun fact. Uh, okay. Weeping Bell. Ah, I just said Weeping Bell. So yes, you can get your Weeping Bell here. It'll be level 36 and with a Leaf Stone, which I actually do have in my bag. You can evolve it into a Victory Bell. So this is a good time to get it. There is a Rare Candy right here. Look at that. I finally figured out items. Uh, in this little house right here, we are actually going to put Littlefoot up front. Because this is a Move Tutor. But no one will take it for you. Hmm, hmm. You, that Venusaur. Oh, this is the one. This is the Pokemon. Will you allow it? Will you allow your Venusaur to learn my Frenzy Plant? So this is a move tutor that will teach Frenzy Plant. Uh, yes, let's see what Frenzy Plant does before we give it to Littlefoot. The foe is hit with an enormous branch. The user can't move on the next turn. So this is kind of like the grass version of Hyper Beam. If you had a Charizard or a uh, Blastoise at this point, or if you chose Charmander or Squirtle as your starter, you would basically get the, the fire version of this and the water version of this. 
Uh, this is actually like pretty good move, so I'm actually gonna replace um, Leech Seed with it. We're at the point now where we won't be in too many dangerous battles, especially with the full team. So I won't be Leech Seeding too much. There is a chance that I might poison you. Uh, so we'll keep that on for now. And we'll just surf on down to the uh, through the waterfall. We can't go up the waterfall. We don't have the HM for waterfall, but we can at least go down. And we're going to go into this game corner right here. That way we can continue this game on the islands. Uh-oh. This guy's pacing. Now, where's Lestelle gotten to today? She always brings me lunch every day, right about now. Hmm. You there. Are you a friend of Lestelle's? Have you seen Lestelle around? I don't know where she might be. She should have been here long ago. Lestelle's a cutie. She got my look. So what if someone... What if something happened to my Lestelle? Please, help me find her. Please go search Three Island. Oh, what the game? Oh, we got a biker. Uh, do we have to take down another bike gang? Because I am so down for that. All right, so now we got to go to Three Island. So I will see you when I get there. And we are at Three Island. This guy is just doing circles around uh, this this lady. I'll call the police. And uh, we're already healed up, but just in case I lose, let me just heal up again. That way we, we don't have to go all the way back to, to one island or, or two island. If we were to faint, but I know we won't. So we got a couple of bikers to deal with in order to get to Lestelle. Um, and as I said, we'll probably explore one island and two island and three island a little bit more next episode. Just want to be conscious of everybody's time. Um, are you the boss? Get back to Kanto right now. Huh? I just got here, pal. What's with the hostile attitude? It's mighty cold of you. Your gang followers have been raising havoc on their bikes. Do you have any idea how much trouble they've caused on us at the island? No, man. I don't get it at all. Look at this place. What do you do for entertainment? You ought to be thanking us for listening up to the sleeper village. I don't know why I'm getting country, but hey. If you insist, you can try making a sleeve. Grr, you cowards. So tough in a pack. Uh-oh. This guy noticed us. And we're going to go into a battle. Yeah, we're, we're going to take him down. This is going to be some uh, pretty good work for, again... Uh, oops. Oopsies. Well, Littlefoot's going to get some experience. I forgot to switch that. Whoops. Uh, this is going to be pretty good work for, again, Lana, Terry, and Spike. Uh, as they have moves that are super effective and types that are super effective against uh, these biker goons. So that's where most of my grinding will... And, of course, we miss Psychic. Great. And we miss Psychic again. Okay, Lana. Come on, Lana. You are way, way better than this. Lana! Hit Psychic. There we go. Golly. Only took a couple of tries, but, but we did it. We did it. Uh, Grimer, we're going to switch to Spike uh, just because Lana's accuracy is lowered and I don't want to elongate this battle. So one dig should do the job. Welcome, Spike. Welcome to the episode. How are you? Oh, not much, Tim. I'm just going to go dig a hole right here. Yep, dig, dig, dig. Are you going to use Minimize? Yep, you're going to use Minimize. So hopefully, uh, hopefully we hit dig because, again, I don't want to elongate this battle any further. Good, Spike. I believe we have one or two more to take down. Um, so this will be fun. Do I have an opportunity to heal or... Nope. Aren't you from Kanto? You should be on our side. Um, well, yeah, I, I mean, I, I guess that's a valid point, but... Oh. Uh, I, I should have switched back Lana, but... You know what? We're still going to beat him. We have six Pokemon. He only has one. If this one coughing takes us down, then... Really need to reevaluate the team. Psychic. This will be a one hit. There we go. Nice job, Lana. And always getting experience for Littlefoot isn't bad as well. And I believe now is the time we, we battle the gold boss. Right? Nope. One more before the boss? Okay, well, I can take down all these bikers, so it's not that, that big of an issue. Um, a Grimer. 
we are going to go back to Spike for this one. Uh, we'll just switch off between Mana and Spike. Um, but we are actually all getting to a good level. I do need to grind up Little Foot a little bit more, but we do have plenty of opportunities, let's say. There's a bunch of swimmers that we haven't battled yet, so it should be pretty easy work for both Usain and Littlefoot to, to get some more experience and to gain some levels. I'll do that grinding off screen in between episodes. And Grimer goes down. That definitely won't be enough to get to level 41 for Spike, but if it is, that'd be pretty cool. No, nope, it's not. How many bikers can we beat in a row? Oh, now it's boss time. I believe this guy basically just has a wheezing and a muck. Uh, I should have written this down in my script. Whoopsies! Yeah, he has a wheezing and a muck. So we'll switch to Lana uh, for wheezing, and then we'll go to Spike for muck. So let's go. I need to get Chonk in this battle somehow. I need to get Chonk in this episode. Maybe not this battle, but th this episode for sure. Um, so I think we'll put Chonk out front for another couple of battles. Lana is hurt by poison. And next will be his muck, so we'll just switch to Spike, dig it down. It might take a couple of digs, um, but, you know, that's okay. That's why we're here. We're here to watch some Pokemon. We're here to watch some battling. Uh, this will definitely get Spike to level 41. Yeah, you can't, you can't screech me if I'm underground. Yeah, this will take two digs. Uh, I'm not going to risk him using Minimize. Let's just Thrash. Yeah, that'll do the job. Level 41, welcome Spike. Yeah, go right on hanging around with these hayseeds. That is that is an insult I have never heard before. Uh, oh, we got a full restore from this guy. That's nice. You hayseed. What? <laughs> uh, let's see. Lestal went off towards Bond Bridge a while ago. I'm going to heal up, but I think now is a good time in this video for you guys to like this video. And then comment whatever you want. Uh, you know, how's your day going? What did you eat for lunch or dinner or breakfast? Whenever you're watching this video, uh, this is also going to be a great day. I think we're all going to have a great day, so comment below how you're doing. Uh, I am going to put Chonk out front. We do actually have a couple of trainers uh, let's get through, so I think this is a good, good opportunity to do a little uh, bit of a speed run. How does that sound? And I will definitely have to get subscribed to cut uh, down some of these trees to get some of these items. So uh, yeah, let's do a little bit of a uh, speed run with Chunk. Here we go. So Chonk is trying to learn Sleep Talk. This is a move that will uh, randomly do uh, an, a, one of the other three attacks while we're sleeping. I'm going to lean against teaching from it. Like I said, I don't think I'll be using Rest a lot because Chonk is super, super powerful and can take a bunch of hits. Uh, I don't foresee using Rest, so I won't be teaching Sleep Talk. But it's actually not a bad move uh, with Rest, especially with Body Slam and Strength. It would randomly use one of them or could randomly use Rest. Um, so I'm going to refrain from that. Okay, back to this little speed run.
Okay, and we're back here right in front of the Berry Forest. Um, sorry about that speedrun and sorry about me having some difficulties getting back here. Um, but Chonk did a great job getting, getting through some battles. Uh, so let's hop on in. But first, I uh, put Terry up front and we're going to slap on a Max Repel uh, to make sure we don't get any wild Pokemon coming our way. And let's hop into the Berry Forest. We have to find Lestelle here. Uh, which isn't too big of an issue. We just have to get through a bunch of these little mazes. That's why I put on this Max Repel. Don't, again, don't want to elongate this uh, any further. But let's see if we got any items. Uh, these are probably just going to be berries, if anything. But there's an item right here. Can I not click on it? Oh, okay. I guess I can't click on it. Luckily, I need the item finder. Uh, do I need to go this way? Yeah. Oh, but there is an item over there. Oh, be scanned. We gotta hop on Surf, or Lana. <laughs> well, I guess we have to Surf, but also get on Lana. And we have found Lestelle. Whimper, Sniff. Oh, please help! A scary Pokemon appeared there a little while ago. It kept scaring. It made Lestelle scared. I'm too scared to move, but I want to go home. Oh, here it comes again. No, oh, go away! Wow, I want my daddy! And this mysterious Pokemon will be a... Hypno, it'll be a level 30 Hypno, so Terry's going to take it down with a couple of bites. Uh, maybe an Ancient Power, maybe a Wing Attack, who knows? Flinch, please! Use Poison Gas, great. That's uh, that's going to poison us, yeah. Yeah, not, not good. Uh, we're going to get hurt by Poison a little bit, as always. Let's do uh, some Ancient Power. Oh, that was so scary. Thank you. Lestelle came to pick some berries. You can have this. The Ayapapa Berry. What's your name? Lestelle scared, so I can't go with you to my daddy's house. Okay, let's go home. So you rescued Lestelle. How can I thank you? Yeah, let's... How can you thank me, Mr. Man? How did you know that I love rare rocks and gems? Well, uh, Celio or Bill told me to just hand you the meteorite. So, that's how I knew. And we received a Moonstone, which is a great item to have to evolve some Pokemon. Let's go back to uh, One Island. Let me heal first. I'll actually see you when I'm back in One Island. And re repels. And we're back in One Island. Let's go talk to Bill and Celio real quick. Uh, yeah, we're going to save everything. Oh, yeah, we saved... We got it done. PC's up and running. Well done, Bill and Celio. Good job, guys. I had quite an adventure myself. And we are going to go back to Kanto. And I think this will be a great time to end the episode. Uh, this episode, we went to one island, two island, and three island after beating Blaine at the Cinnabar Island gym. Uh, Bill is just going to tell me we can go back there. We just have to go to Vermilion City. But we're going to end the episode here. Uh, thank you guys so much again for watching. Like this video. Subscribe to the channel. We are only 26 away from replacing a Pokemon and a couple of episodes away from that being invalid. Uh, so definitely like this video. Subscribe to my channel. Comment below whatever you want. It could be anything that, you, that comes to your mind. Talk about what you ate. How was your day? I also made a new Twitter, at ReallyTimmyBYT. Please go follow that. You can follow me on Twitch as well. I'll get a stream up and running sometime in the next couple of days. Um, so follow me on that. And everybody, just have a great day. I'll see you soon.